I actually joined ROTC not knowing what I wanted. The semester before I started ROTC, I was nervous just because I didn't want to start another minor and I didn't know anybody in the program. But all the stories I heard about it was, oh, you guys get to go swimming in the morning some days and you get to go for jogs and some days we even have fun days. We play dodgeball, basketball, football some days. You get all these learning experiences. You get to go to seminars, that are like actually interesting seminars that they talk about like cool stories and stuff, not just, you know, what's the social status of the economy right now, like fun stuff. And I was like, okay, that sounds interesting, but like, I'm a pretty like open person, but sometimes it's still, it's still nerve wracking just to think you don't know anybody. And if, I think this moment, I, first time I came there, I knew one person and now I'm platoon sergeant right now and everybody in the platoon. And, like I have my own group of friends that I kind of like socially hang out with a lot. And that's most of my friend group right now, honestly. Like it's just a giant family. And I think that it's really important for college, especially because you have a people like-minded that always have your back. So it was really helpful for me. It's great because three days a week I get to work out and I get to do it with like my friends that I've made in the program. And you don't know anybody, so like, it's a great way to meet people too. Like we all hang out after class, like we go we go to different events together. It's just kind of, a, you can just test the waters on your own and we've had people do that and then leave after and it's kind of unfortunate because you know, we all hang out and we get to meet new people, but at the end of the day, like you don't have to stay in the program if you didn't want to. So it's a great way to just see if you'd like it or not. There's no repercussions. And that's what, I, I think that's what a lot of people like. But most people, they do that and they actually like the program, and they stick with it. Because we all enjoy it, so it's just kind of hanging out with your buddies and you're getting an A and you're doing class time during, but it's, it's just fun. I would say like, my confidence really is like, my confidence is a lot higher than it was, for sure. It really like shows how like, getting ready to be like the upperclassmen to like lead the team. So like, they definitely look at me towards like, even today I just got out of practice before I got here. They really like, they all looked to me and said, hey, we don't remember what to do, or like, we, we don't want to go first. So like, I had to go before everybody because I had that confidence learning from like leadership here. Cause like, we were really forced into that. <laughs> so like, civilian life, it really like pushes you to like do it like better, I would say. Oh, when we do like projects or like group projects, or even like just like a presentation, working well with others is like, that camaraderie is like natural in the army. So like having people that aren't used to working with groups, they kind of look up to you and be like, hey, I, I don't really know what like to do. And I'm like, don't worry, I got this. <laughs> you know, we learn about how to be a leader, mainly um, specifically for the army, but it, you know, we're here to get better at our leadership skills and our attributes. It's given me a lot more confidence. So like, for example, like when I'm doing group projects like when I was in high school you know I was the one that was like laying back and you know following the, like, the smarter kids and stuff like that and um, I wasn't really much of a person that you know I was a friendly guy people wanted to be my friends but no one would necessarily want to follow me now I feel like I'm like the almost the exact opposite outside of ROTC I'm the one that could be a vocal leader I'm the one that could take charge and stuff a little bit more you know, people want to follow me, you know, I'm not forcing people to follow me, but they want to follow me and it feels, you know, it feels good that, you know, people have that, you know, confidence and that trust in me and I, f I feel like that's really like what it's done, it's given me more character. I've gotten a lot more experience through it, I feel like I've grown as a person because of it. You think of ROTC as like the stuff that, you know, it's military stuff, right? It's just what you learn, it's just, but it, that stuff can carry over into the personal life and teach you some really good life lessons. ROTC is so well knit that you feel like everyone's your friend. Even if you don't talk to them as much as what you do the other people, you just know them. You know, that's the nice thing. You always have this, it's almost like a support group. When you join this program, it doesn't matter where you came from or who you are. As long as you put in the work and you show that you care about others, people are gonna wanna be around you. It's just what it is. If you see this video and you want to join ROTC and you're, you're close to us, definitely join this program because Ferris State has got, has got something different than the other programs that I've seen so far. We may be a smaller program because we're one of those schools that don't necessarily have to go to the battalion level where they always are at, but it just brings you closer and you're definitely, you become a better cadet for sure. So if you're around here, come here. <laughs>